Y'all both, y'all both, yeah, both want to go at the same time? I don't care. What? For the bleachers? Yeah. No, I want to go at the end. All right, who's up first? Isaac. Oh. You guys, let's go. Okay. Ready? Set. Go. When he reaches the top, you go. Get ready. Yeah, you got to come down. I didn't even jump from that high, I jumped from the last I step. I didn't even jump from that high! Yeah. That cost him a second. 15, 17, 18. What was it? 20. Dang, bro, I had a feeling it was like 19. I beat him one more second. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> not too shabby, boys, not too shabby. You guys are doing really good. You guys are really starting to shape up into men now. Had a good workout? No. Feeling good? No. Way. It was really easy. Oh All right, we on our way back? Face it. Face it to me. All right, face it to the middle though, like put it right here. There you go. We crash, we crash, we crash. No. no. There goes uh, five dollars of gas right there. <laughs> five bucks. You know, Isaac always asks me if we could go for a bike ride. He tells me all the time how he loves riding his bike outside and he always asked me if instead of running on the treadmill or running outside if we could just go for a bike ride so we're here in april the weather's looking kind of nice outside so i thought let's treat him so let's go for that bike ride We have a flat tire. We need the pump. All right, so I was able to mount my tripod onto the bike. Hope and pray it doesn't fall, but I think we should be good to go. Hey, Isaac just got here. We're about to rock and roll. My idea for this workout was to do something like a spin class, except instead of riding on a stationary bike, we would be outside with a nice fresh air. Now that we're in April, the weather's feeling a little bit warmer and it's good enough to work out right now, but it wasn't always like this. Ever since we began this transformation in December, we've been working out in the cold weather. Here in New Jersey, December, January, February, and March are the coldest months, where it can drop all the way down to 20 degrees. Imagine that, it's already hard running outside, but running outside in the cold weather, that's a whole nother level. And that's what we've been doing for the past four months. Alright, that's it for today's workout. We just did a outdoor spin class.
So, what makes Isaac special? There's no way a 13 year old can transform his life so fast and get these results. What's the secret? Well, I'm going to tell you guys right now, there's no secret. What most people don't understand is this didn't happen overnight. We started this in December. Seven months later, 200 and something amount of days later, Isaac got to be into the position that he is right now. And he had to work his butt off for that. It's like you're making a really good soup. trying to make a really good soup and you put one ingredient and you think that's gonna make that's gonna make it into a really good soup you're gonna be completely wrong to make a really good soup it's a combination of a lot of small ingredients those small ingredients together make a really good soup not one ingredient you know I've been coming in for six years six years you've been sticking it to me I want to know how come you don't want to know yeah I want to know how come you want to know Today, right now, it's 7 12. I'm about to go to school. I made my shake for the morning, which is my breakfast. I won't be eating it until 1.30, so I'll see you then. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm about to eat some chicken breast. Good morning, it's 7.13, and I'm about to drink my shake. I won't be recording up to my lunch time because I'm going to be in school. Okay, so I came a bit later than I thought from school. So right now it's 1.36 and I'm about to eat my food. For you guys that are looking to step forward or try something new that you've never done before and you're afraid of taking that first step, I was afraid of first starting working out too. It's like jumping into an ocean. You have no idea what to expect. And the same thing goes for Isaac when he first started with me. He was so nervous, so afraid of starting. But it is exactly that moment when you're most afraid that you jump in. Otherwise. You end up being stuck in the same place for the rest of your life and that is no good. <laughs> 